All right, this Christian guy is gonna teach you a Hebrew phrase, but first a quick story. I was sitting at Passover dinner last night at Seder next to Dr. Rick Hodes, the CNN hero. He got that award and he works in Ethiopia providing critical medical care uh, to people who have no access to it. And he comes to the United States with a heavy heart, thinking about this one girl he can't help who has a tumor that's threatening her life and needs a particular specialty, but it's so expensive and so hard for him to get. He goes to bed one night and he oversleeps. Now this is the kind of guy that has this attitude that everything happens for a purpose, for a reason. So even when he oversleeps, he's like, there must be a reason in this. Well, he can't do his morning prayer. So after his morning meetings, he asks for a synagogue where he can get his morning prayer. And he goes to the synagogue, happens to be praying next to a man, asks who he is. The man says, I'm a doctor. And he goes, well, what kind of doctor? And the man says he's a doctor that has this particular specialty, which turns out to be the exact doc kind of doctor that this woman with a tumor needs. And the man, the doctor, Dr. Nussbaum, offers to do the surgery for free. Think about this. A Muslim girl who goes to a Catholic orphanage is helped by these two Jewish doctors. This is the glory that we see in the world often amidst all the challenges. And I'll tell you this, the Hebrew phrase I wanna teach you is gamzala tova, gamzala tova. It means in everything there is good, there is purpose, there is meaning. That attitude actually can very create that very truth. Look for the meaning, look for the purpose, no matter what happens to you. And if you can't find it, be the meaning, be the purpose, be the blessing, be the good. This world needs more of that spirit and that attitude.